the University of California at Davis. This is News Watch. One of the most popular tourist spots on the UC Davis campus this summer has been the Botanical Conservatory. The reason? This plant, the Amorphophallus titanum, also known as the corpse flower. We describe the, uh, the reproductive structure as having broken its water at about noon today. Okay, and what it did is it, uh, earlier today, this whole skirt right here was closed up around that, uh, that structure in the middle and uh, it started opening up around noon and around 2 or 3 p.m. it started generating this, this smell coming off the stock here and uh, it smells pretty bad right now. The plant native to the island of Sumatra grew from seed at UC Davis and took eight years to flower. At three and a half feet tall the plant began unfurling its huge maroon bloom. Uh, it actually only smells for about eight hours the first day that it's open. Here, hang out for a second so you can really enjoy... Oh, no, it's not possible, huh? This plant has attracted all kinds of interest. I'm really attracted to fragrant flowers, but this one I have to sort of appreciate it, even though it is sort of gruesome smelling. The smell is produced when the plant converts starch stored in the stem into energy, which heats up oils inside the flower, attracting flies that pollinate the plant. This species only blooms for about 24 hours. The plant then becomes exhausted and the flower collapses. It may not bloom again for years. Reporting from UC Davis, I'm Paul Fotenauer. For more information, please log on to broadcast.ucdavis.edu.